Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this particular video tutorial, we are going to see uh, again a very important topic uh, from the uh, Hive tutorial series is how we can use the exist clause uh, in the Hive. So basically, uh, there, there are many situations where uh, you need to find uh, records from one table based on a condition or based on some data from some other table. Okay, so I have a scenario for you uh, and for that let me show you some uh, data. So here we have two tables, one is employee table. So let me just select the records, employee, select star from employee and we have three employees here and the column represents like ID, name, uh, city, department in which this particular employee is working and salary. This is the typical employee data. And there is one more table that I have is select star from alumni employee EMP. Okay. And I just have only one record in this particular table. And uh, the data is like the employee ID. Uh, let's say suppose this particular employee has left, it, uh, left this particular organization. Uh, so that particular record will go uh, into this alumni table and just one sample column i have just you know mocked up this particular data so the status you can say right so employee id and the status is alumni of uh, that particular employee okay so now let's say what we want to do is the the kind of a skeleton data for a employee table is maintained is getting maintained in the main employee table but what i want to find is from all of these employee which are the employees who are currently are not working with this particular organization based on this particular scenario that I'm uh, putting in front of you. There could be any scenario, but just to demonstrate the usability of this exist clause, I have just taken this particular scenario. Okay. So what we want to do is based on a condition, like what is our condition that that record has to be present that this particular, that particular employee has to be present in the alumni EMP table so that we can say this particular employee uh, id with a is equal to 2 is not there with the organization but if you see the plain employee data there is no way you can find this so this is our problem that based on the filter condition which is actually not it you know you cannot put that particular filter condition on the on this particular table you are dependent on some other table to get that filter condition right here so as as long as the record is present in the alumni emp table that means the status of that particular employee is like that employee is not working with uh, the organization anymore but if you see this employee table there is no way you can find that whether what is the status of the employee if, if he is actively working currently or he has left the organization there is no status okay so let's see how we can write the uh, query for that so here the main table is employee table and we wanted to find the records from the main table so for that we have to give select star from employee okay and i am giving uh, some alias okay uh, let's say e1 now where okay so i'll just write it on the next line where now after where condition what we generally give a filter condition basically but our filter condition lies in some other table right and what is our filter condition says that the record id i mean sorry employee id should be present on this particular table alumni emp table so that means unless and until this particular employee id exists in this particular table our filter condition will not get satisfied okay so just uh, you know understand the usability uh, of exist clause where exists right what does it exist select star from the another table name alumni emp where and the alias for this table is let's say alumni emp aemp okay where now what is the uh, common column in this particular uh, in in these two tables is the employee id right where even dot id should match with aemp dot id okay so this is my 
वेयर कंडीशन टू ग्रुप सॉरी टू मैच द डेटा इन बिटवीन दीज टू टेबल्स ओके सो आई जस्ट प्रेस सेमी कॉल इन एंड प्रेस एंटर ओके आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड दिस क्वेरी सिलेक्ट स्टार फ्रॉम एम्प्लॉय ई वन वेयर अनलेस एंड एंटिल दिस पर्टिकुलर कंडीशन ई वन डॉट आई डी इज इक्वल टू ए ई एम पी डॉट आई डी अनलेस एंड एंटिल दिस पर्टिकुलर कंडीशन मैचेस फ्रॉम दिस टेबल अवर एग्जिस्ट क्लॉज विल द कंडीशन फॉर दिस एग्जिस्ट क्लॉज विल नॉट मैच सो अल्टीमेटली एज अ रिजल्ट ऑफ दिस क्वेरी वॉट वी एक्सपेक्ट इट शूड रिटर्न अस द एंटायर दिस रेकॉर्ड बिकॉज वी हैव रिटर्न सेलेक्ट स्टार फ्रॉम एम्प्लॉय ओके सो लेट सी इट इज ऑब्वियसली गोइंग टू ट्रिगर अ मै प्रोड्यूस जॉब सो लेट्स वेट टिल द टाइम वी गेट द रिजल्ट so as we see here since the only one id is there uh, in the alumni employee table so it has just written this particular entire record from the employee table that uh, this id where employee id is equal to to raghav is no more uh, working with the current organization for which the employee data is there okay so i hope uh, you understood the usability of the hives exist clause and you'll be able to use that wherever you need that okay thanks guys thanks for watching this video and i'll see you in the next one thank you